Welcome to Automate M365. In this tutorial, I'll show you how to automatically send an email after a Microsoft form is submitted using Power Automate. This ensures that responses are instantly acknowledged or forwarded, saving you valuable time. Let's begin by creating the Microsoft form. Go to forms.microsoft.com and sign in with your Microsoft 365 account. Click on New Form. At the top, give your form a clear name, for example, Customer Feedback Form or Event Registration. You can also add a short description to explain the purpose. Now add questions. Click Add New and choose the type of question you want. Add text fields for names or email addresses, choice fields for multiple choice questions, or ratings, and dates depending on your needs. If you want to send replies back to the respondent, include an email field. When you're finished, your form is automatically saved, and you can preview it to check how it looks. Now that the form is ready, let's automate the email. Go to powerautomateatflow.microsoft.com and click Create. Select Automated Cloud Flow. Name your flow. For the trigger, search for Microsoft Forms and choose when a new response is submitted. Then click Create. Next, select the form you just made from the drop-down list. If it's not visible, make sure it has been saved in Microsoft Forms. To access the answers, add a new step, search for Microsoft Forms, and choose Get Response Details. Select the same form again. Now create the email. Add a new step, search for Outlook, and choose Send an Email, V2. In the To field, type the recipient's email address. This could be your own, your team's, or a dynamic email address if you captured one in the form. In the subject line, type something like New Form Submission Received. In the body, insert dynamic content from the form, such as the respondent's name, email, or any other answers you collected. Before finishing, always test your flow. Save the flow, click Test, and submit a sample form response.
Check your inbox to confirm that the email arrives with the details you selected. You've now created an automated workflow that sends an email immediately after a Microsoft form is submitted. This simple but powerful automation is perfect for confirmations, alerts, or team notifications. In the next video, we'll build on this example and add a condition action. With a condition, you can send different emails depending on the answers provided in the form. For example, one type of email if someone selects yes and another if they select no. If this tutorial helped you, don't forget to like the video and subscribe to Automate M365 for more Microsoft 365 automation guides. Found this video helpful? Leave a like. Thanks for watching.